Joy said the cold temperatures we will see here pale when compared to what millions of other Americans are dealing with right now. The Chicago River has already frozen over. You can see much of the river is covered with blocks of ice. And here's how they keep trains running on time in this extreme cold. Yes, they set fires along the tracks to prevent freezing. News 4 Jacks reporter Vic Michelucci is joining us live from Philadelphia. He had a layover, a layover in Chicago this morning. Vic, any flight delays or cancellations in your travels? Tom, fortunately for us, we did not have any flight delays or cancellations. Actually, we were a little bit ahead of schedule, but we looked at the board, especially at Chicago Midway Airport, and we saw about half of the flights in and out were canceled. So there are problems, and we are just beginning to see uh, the start of it. As we came landing down, we flew over into Indiana and then Illinois. We just saw so much ice, so much snow. But I want to show you a video from about 15 minutes ago here outside of Philadelphia. So we are heading to the Allentown area of Pennsylvania. The roads right now are wet. That is rain. But in just a couple of minutes, it's going to turn. It's going to freeze. We're going to get snow. There's a lot of snow in the forecast out here as the lows over the next 24 hours are going to be around 1 or 2 degrees Fahrenheit wind chill temperatures in the negatives. So as we were heading on the highway, we did see a lot of snow plows. They are preparing for that snow that's going to cause a lot of problems. But I want to show you a video from Chicago as we're making our approach into Midway Airport. It really does look like the Arctic tundra. It looks like Antarctica there. We saw so much snow, so much ice, and it certainly was causing backups on the road backups in the airport and it's going to be a domino effect over the next couple of days because things are going to get much worse before they get any better so this could affect not only the flights here in the northeast and the midwest it's going to affect mail service a lot of transportation the trucking industry could be put on hold because these roads are very dangerous so i want to show you what it looks like right now through our earth cam in chicago you can see it is just frigid temperatures there going to be right around zero degrees Fahrenheit, but we're looking at wind chills much, much colder. It is the windy city, and the wind chills could be as low as negative 40 degrees. Here in Philadelphia, it's going to be just a tad bit warmer, but we are expecting <laughs> some very cold temperatures and some snow any minute now. For now, we're live in Pennsylvania. I'm Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, the local station.